Do you have a pet peeve, something that really bugs you when it comes to social media? Anything that really gets under your skin? Uh, something that bothers you the most when it comes to social I'm media? I'm trying to think. Uh, can you give me an example? Well, I mean, some people, it's the trolls. Okay, okay. Uh, some people, it could be some of the stuff that you mentioned, right? Uh, yeah. You know, people seeing others on social media and they feel like they got to keep up with them. Probably that, okay. probably that. But but I don't really try to let nothing bother me. I just, if it bothers me, I try to stay away from it. You know what I mean? Now, how do you deal with negative or hateful comments? It don't bother me, really. Because I just be like, first of all, I barely read the comments. But if they do come in with stuff, I really just be laughing at it because these people don't know me. You know what I'm saying? They don't know me. They just behind the screen commenting. I don't, I don't let that phase me. They ain't got nothing going on. They ain't got nothing going on because if they had something going on, they wouldn't be spending the time out of their day to comment that. These days, what do you think, if we had a pie chart, 100%, what do you think the comments that you get are negative versus positive? Um, I'm going to say they are positive because at the end of the day, um, in my eyes, they are positive. Now, what about constructive criticism? I know you barely read comments, uh -huh. but maybe there was a time when you read comments. I don't know. Now, some people, they can leave a comment just bashing you, trolling you, hating on you, that sort of thing. But sometimes people can leave a comment and it might not be a positive comment because it's a criticism, but it's not really downing you. Yeah. It's trying to make you see a perspective of what may be happening. Yeah, no, no, I like them comments. You do? Yeah, I do. Like, okay, when I say I don't read comments, I don't, I don't really read too many Instagram comments just because I get so many, but I definitely read all my YouTube comments. You do? Yeah, and I don't really get too much hate on YouTube. If I do, it just be a troll. But the constructive cr criticism, I do take that. Um, I take that, like, what's it called, like? Into consideration? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ever listen to them? Listen. Like, ever, somebody like, say a constructive criticism comment, and you're like, I agree with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, they'll tell me stuff I should do on YouTube, shouldn't it? Okay. So I'll take that, yeah. Definitely listen to them. Ever turn comments off? Nah. Don't do that. Delete comments. Maybe one or two, but um, ain't something I just do, you know what I mean? What about clapping back? You ever clap back at a comment? I had before. Actually, recently I did. I think somebody had, because I was under my friend picture, and they was like, um, they said something like, oh, you be under everybody comments, da -da -da. I was like, I commented them back. I said, yo, mama. <laughs> did they go back and forth with you, or you stopped I didn't check. I don't want to check. Now, what about blocking profiles, like on Instagram? I don't do block. I don't block. People. You don't block either. No, because they just, Unless it's like something really bad, but I don't take the time of the day to block nobody because at the end of the day, they just making me my money. Another viewer, they make me my money. Mm. I ain't no need to block them. What about death threats? Ever received death threats online? Probably. I don't, I don't read them, though. Never took them serious enough to. Nah, ain't nobody gone. Nah. What about stalkers? This is something that I've uh, been seeing and hearing about. Uh, has anybody ever crossed that imaginary boundary from being online mm -hmm. to seeing you in real life? A stalker? Luckily, no. No. I mean, by God's grace, no. And I hope that never happens. Stuff like that worry you? No, I don't worry me because at the end of the day, I'm protected by God. And I know God ain't going to, you know what I'm saying, let it happen. 